Whether you have a Valentine or a celebrate with your friends, people love receiving flowers. KSBY's Aaron Faye spoke with local florists about what people can expect this Valentine's Day. They were unanimous. We spoke with several family-owned floral shops and they said, please get your orders in for Valentine's Day ahead of time. Florists around town are saying order bouquets early because supply chain issues are affecting matters of the heart. Hard goods, vases, oasis, and uh, anything that is uh, not perishable, it's hard to get. At Albert's Florist in San Luis Obispo, supply chain delays affect their vendors and the shop is short-handed. There are lots of, uh, unfortunately, extra expenses to get flour this day that reflects maybe on our, our products, but we'll do our best. Owner Barkhev Abadjian recommends ordering at least a week in advance. Red Rose, of course, is always uh, in demand for this uh, thing, and we, we, are, uh, we have ample uh, Red Rose, I think. People are also buying dried flowers. This is one of our Valentine's bouquets, so it's just a mix of blush and purple. Flower is really soft, romantic. At Idlewild Floral in San Luis Obispo, the owner says they get a lot of last minute orders. We're exclusively a dried and preserved flower florist, so we don't actually work with fresh flowers. So the supply chain disruptions haven't affected us as much. They are able to order their products months in advance and store it. Carla Wingent recommends ordering your florals this week because you have two weeks left before Valentine's Day. And if you are sending florals through the mail across the U.S., it leaves some time for any delays. Reporting from the newsroom, Erin Fegg, KSBY News. At Albert's Flores, they offer contactless delivery. The owner says this is their 42nd year celebrating Valentine's Day with the community.